Hi everyone, this is Maria's Budgeting. Welcome back to my channel if you're returning and welcome if you are new. So today I'm going to be doing my cash envelope and sinking fund stuffing for the second paycheck of December. Here on my tray I do have a total of 1064 so we're going to count really quick to make sure that that is the correct amount. So I have one, two, three, four. I'm going to count with my calculator today. So 400, 50, and, 50 and 1, so 100. 20s, we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60. So 360 in 20s. 10s, we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4. 140. We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. And then ones, we should have nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Which gives me um, 1,064. So let's go ahead and get started. Oh, I completely forgot to unstuff my wallet. So we have a little bit more money than what we have. Um, let's see how much we have. We have $1 in dates. Plus one. Gas, we have... 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Groceries. We have 40. So plus 40. And that is it. So we have a total of 1,125 that we are stuffing today. So let's go ahead and get started. First off with dates, um, dates I am going to stuff $50. So we're going to do the usual, which is two 20s and a 10. So that gives me 50. Moving on to gas, we are stuffing 100. We're going to do a 50, two 20s and a 10. These wallets are available in my Etsy shop if you guys are interested. I do have a couple different colors, so the link is going to be down below. I also do have some receipts to scan into Fetch, but I do have them in my vehicle. Um, so Fetch is an app that you can download to your phone. You can scan receipts. They give you points for the receipts and the points you can go ahead and redeem for gift cards. So if you guys are interested in signing up using my code, I'm going to leave it on the screen along with down below in the description box. Moving on to groceries, we're going to do 120, which is going to be all in 20. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. Perfect. Moving on to restaurants, we are going to stuff 50. We're going to do two 20s and a 10. Spending is going to get 50 as well, and for this one, we're just going to do a $50 bill. I'm hoping to not spend this, and hopefully I'm able to just place it in my spending um, sinking fund next time. So that is my goal. I, that's exactly why I put a $50 bill, so hopefully that incentivizes me to not spend that money. Moving on to my pink binder, I am stuffing all three envelopes. So parents is gonna get 125 per usual. And I believe we have 125 in there, so that should give me 250. So we have one, two, 20, 40, 45, 50, perfect. Moving on to Toyota. It's getting 300, so we should have 600, and I already scheduled my payment for Monday. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600. I'm going to move these um, bills to the top because I believe the ones are not in frame, so there we go. Um, Verizon is going to get 30 today. And I'm not quite sure how much the bill is going to be. Um, the good thing, though, is that I do have an extra paycheck this month. So 
I'm able to stuff a little bit more if I need to. Moving on to the sinking funds, I do have my first sinking funds binder here and we're going to go ahead and start off with Adventures. And Adventures is going to get a $5 bill today. So Adventures has 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 65. Moving on to Beauty. Beauty is going to get 20, so that's enough for my threading. So I have 30. And I shouldn't need anything else, so that's good. Birthdays is going to get 30. I do have a lot of birthdays at the beginning of the year um the main ones are my sister's best friend my sister and my boyfriend they're all three in march but i also do have other birthdays like my mom in april um my boyfriend's dad in january my boyfriend's mom in february so there's a lot of birthdays more than that um at the beginning of the year so i need to stuff a lot more into birthdays but currently birthdays has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17. No, no. Yeah, 15, 16, 17, 18. <laughs> I don't know how I counted that, but it's 118 in birthdays. Car insurance is fully funded at 2000. Car maintenance is getting a $5 bill. I do have to get my uh, maintenance done really soon here, but I do have a package and I believe I still have three oil changes. So hopefully I'm able to save enough for another package if they have the promotion at the time that I need it. So we have one, two, three, four, four, 50, four, 70, four, 90, 500, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31. And I do have enough money for it because I believe it was about $300 or a little bit over 300 for a package of five um, oil changes along with other things. Um, so I have enough, but hopefully if they have that promotion when I do need the package, um, I will have this money still in here. Knock on wood, I will not need that. Um, car tags, I am not stuffing right now. I am doing a December savings challenge to fully fund this and I'm hoping to fully fund it um, by the end of this year so I don't have to worry about it next year. My car tags are due November 2024, so I'm trying to full, um, fully fund this before the year ends. Moving on to Casino, it is getting five. And I believe it's at 35, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, yes. Moving on, Christmas is fully funded for the year. I do have some placeholders in here which do not accurately accurately represent what I have in the bank, but I'm just going to go ahead and leave them in here and then at the end of the year I'm going to just remove them. Moving on to clothing. I am going to stuff 10. So you have 10, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42. 42 in clothing. Moving on to electronics, we are stuffing five, which gives me 15. Emergency fund is fully funded at 3,000. Family fund is getting the usual 10. Family Fun has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91. And Fortnite Tuesdays is getting $3 this time. So two, three. So Family, uh, Fortnite Tuesdays, excuse me, has 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 45. So moving on to my second sinking funds binder, I am going to start off with holiday. Oh no, health. <laughs> I forgot that I added health. So health um, is going to get $5. So 
So we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, and 37. I am going to um, order vitamin C pretty soon here. So this envelope is going to come in handy. Moving on to holidays. We are going to stuff 10. And this is mainly for Valentine's Day. So Valentine's Day is my boyfriend and I's anniversary. So this is most likely, or it is what's going to go towards Valentine's Day um, next year. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 130, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So we have 140. Moving on to home, we are going to add 10 per usual. We have 10, 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 470, 490, 510, 520, 30, and 40, 540. And who is ready for, for a bill exchange? I cannot speak today. <laughs> Who's ready for a bill exchange? I am going to be doing one this month at the end of the year. Moving on to household it is going to get five household now has 10 20 25 30 35 36 37 38 39 39 in household investing is getting a five dollar bill today We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, and 22. Medical is fully funded at 300. School is getting 10. I have 3,500 in the bank. 600, 700, 750, 770, 790. 800, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. So we have 3,850 in school. And these placeholders and envelopes are available in my Etsy shop if you guys are interested. Again, link is going to be down below. Moving on to spending, I am going to add $39 into here. Yes. 20, 30, 35, 1, 2, 3, and 4. This hopefully will give me 150. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. 150 so I added 39 in order for me to be at 150 and this is coming out of my rollover money that I took out of my wallet um, some of my paycheck money along with my wallet money is going to go into saving challenges which um, I'm trying to start back up with my saving challenges even if it's a little bit I want to start adding to them so that is what I am doing this video toiletries is getting 10 So we're at 10, 20, 25, 26, 7, 8, 9, and 30. And vacation is also going to get 10. So we have 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 390, 410, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, and 70. Yes, 470, which is great. I'm hoping to be able to add at the end of the year. I do have three paychecks. I'm going to get paid the last day of the year. Um, so I'm hoping to be able to add $30 so we can just leave it at 500. That would be amazing if I'm able to do that. So now I have saving challenges. So first I do have this challenge here, which is from Breathe In Budgets. I was so happy to be able to get my hands on this challenge um, during Black Friday. Um, so I did get it on sale 
and this challenge is very special for her um, and I really admire it. So this savings challenge is into sections, so section one, two, three, and four. The total amount for all four sections is going to total out to be 730. I read the description when I placed my order and she said that one of her friends passed away. So this challenge is in memory of her because her birthday was July 30th. So that is why the total saved is going to be 730 and I thought that was so special. So I'm glad that I was able to get my hands on this. So I am going to start with section one and I'm going to start with the first number, um, which is going to be $10. I am going to remove this um, placeholder that she sent me really quick um, so I can start stuffing the envelopes and I don't get confused with the placeholder. So I am going to add $10. I think this one's a little bit better, so I'm going to take that one. And this is how we're going to start off this savings challenge. I believe I can mark off the diamond like I could draw it in but I think I'm just going to go ahead and leave it as is for now and maybe in the future I will but for now we're just going to go ahead and leave it like that so we started this savings challenge and I'm so excited to be able to accomplish this challenge here okay so there we go all done with this one Moving on to this binder, I ended up moving my savings envelope into here. Sorry, I just moved the camera. And I finally was able to create my $10,000 savings challenge. So now my placeholders and my money is accurate. But I am not going to stuff savings. So I'm just going to put that back. I just wanted to show you guys that I finally created that $10,000 placeholder. This Let Me Adore You Challenge, I am going to skip for now. I am going to do this one here, which is $35. I ended up scratching the $35, so we're going to go ahead and add $35. Okay, so $35. We're going to add that in here. This is a $500 um, challenge, but the envelopes has $1,000. i am just recycling it. I'm just using it again, so this is not accurate, but I'm not going to throw it away. So I'm just reusing it. All right, so we have in this challenge here, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 7, 8, 9, and 40. So we have 140. And I do want to go ahead and scratch off another number. So I'm going to try to find something to scratch it off and I will be right back. All right, so we're going to go ahead and scratch off the next number and it's 18. I think I'm just going to go ahead and leave it at that number because um, I just don't want to risk it. So we're just going to leave it at 18. So moving on to this one, this one is by Sam Crafts and Customs. I already scratched off my two numbers. I believe it was two numbers that I scratched off and it was 20. So first, let me add that money into the envelope. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, and 97. And this challenge is for 250. So let me scratch off some more numbers. Maybe one, maybe two, maybe three. I'm not sure. Let's do this one here. And we're only going to do one. So we're going to do $20 again. This time I was only able to scratch off one. I believe last time I'm almost positive that I did two numbers. Maybe a 15 and a 5. I believe that's what I did last time. But we are going to add this back. And I'm able to reuse the sticky note because I'm going to stuff $20 next time again. 
so that's that now we have our extra here um, which I am going to add this money at the end of the month to my car tax so I have 20 25 30 31 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 I have 38 Okay, so I'm going to do 26 and 9. So I'm going to grab my tweezers that I use. So I'm going to do 26 and 9. Let me just make sure again. 26 plus 9 is 35. So 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5. I'm going to count it one more time. I just want to make sure one more time. 20, 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, 35. So I'm going to add that in here. I did the lowest and the highest number. So for now, that's good to go. And I have $3 left over which I'm just going to add to my Let Me Adoyu challenge. So I'm going to mark it off with this marker here. And we're just going to place it in here. All right. And that is it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.